Hey everyone, today's video are on these face shields. So these UV face shields. Um, I really have like sensitive skin to the sun, so it's really important to me to really protect my face. And so I wear this pretty much in the car because I will say right now, it's just kind of, um, it would be a little weird to wear out in public, but I think that I would like if I was on vacation and really needed that extra protection. But definitely I wear this in the car and it comes in handy for a couple of reasons. Now you're saying, why would you care about in the car? But the rays from the sun does come into your car and will damage your face, um, your arms, whatever is exposed to the sun. And there are lots of pictures out there of people where they will have pictures of a person that shows their left side of their face versus their right side and the damage that's done compared to the left and right where the sun is hitting your face on the left. So definitely try and protect yourself when you're in the car. Don't think that because you have a windshield or a window that it's gonna protect your face. So anyway, I found these options. Um, there's a couple of reasons why I like it is it is a really large visor so it does come out far enough on both the front and the sides to really protect your face and depending on how low you you put it and where the sun is actually hitting you you can get a full coverage um, shade on your face where most hats will only do like um, to the nose and not the bottom of your face and so that's really nice option there so again you can wear this as a full-on like visor to cover your entire face or you can wear it as like just a hat visor and like this. Now, I have found, so I'm shorter, so when I'm in the car, sometimes like the sun visor doesn't cover the sun when I'm driving. And these, you could also like pull over your face or pull down lower so that you don't have that sun blaring in your face and it does work. This one though is a cheaper version. It's kind of like this plastic. And so it's not very clear when you're looking through it. So it kind of doesn't work for that. Um, but again, like if you're going for a walk and you want to protect your whole face, like this is really great if you have the courage to wear it over your face because you do look like someone out of Star Wars. Anyway, so this is what I'm going to say is the more expensive version that I have from Amazon. It does come with this cover because the um, plastic on here is more of a hard plastic versus this flexible plastic. So it is easier to see out of. Like I said, if you're in the car or even if you're just walking and you pull this over your face, you'll be able to see right through it just like sunglasses, which is really nice. And this one's just like um, a little easier to adjust, I feel like, um, I think too, yeah. And then the back, on both of these have a Velcro adjustable back. So now the one thing I don't like about this, so the reason that I bought this, there's a lot of marks here, um, is because most of the ones on Amazon have like a mirror glass, which makes it look really crazy. Um, and um, which I wanted something that was more like this, just plain black. But this one, if you see here has um, this etching, sorry, there's a glare there, um, where you cannot see through that. And so if I wanted to wear this, but just pull it down a little bit, it ends up so that this part here is in my vision and I can't see through that. And I would need to pull it down even more, um, where sometimes I just don't want to pull it that far down. And so that's the bad thing about this. So it's either get the mirror one or get um, this one with this frosted edging of flames. <laughs> you can't see the flames, but again, it does disrupt your view when you're trying to look through it. There are other ones, but they're super expensive. Um, and this one was like only, I think this gray one actually was only like $12. So if you search around, cause there's a ton of them on Amazon, um, anywhere from ranging from, you know, 12 to 30 and above. But yeah, so again, really great option to protect your face, really great for the car because you can use it if 
if your sun visor is not um, low enough for you and it just protects your face really well. I am going to say that I most likely will definitely buy another one of these and use one or maybe use this one, I don't know, when I go on vacation to somewhere tropical because I need that extra protection um, or because I go to places that tend to be super hot. So yeah, so um, I would recommend this if you're really worried about your face. Uh, one other thing too is like when people get chemical peels and they can't like have their face in the sun or other procedures to their face where they should be avoiding the sunlight, these are really great. So I'll put the links in the description. I hope this helped with your buying decision. Thanks a lot. Bye.